right? Straight punch. Oh, straight punch. 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 Well, you're punching out here. I want you to actually punch me in the face. Right? So he comes in. I'm going to pick up here, right? So as I pick up here, I'm going to step across. So I step across here. This is the attack. So this is it. So as he comes in, I pick up here. I pick up here and here. Fine. This is arm break. Now, can I hit here? I can if I want, but I, I hit here. I hit here as I do this. What is this? This is, is the, the last. This is the last one of the hush. Now, are you grazing what you say on that, or are you going for No, I'm coming in to break the elbow. Okay. I'm not overly really concerned what happens to his body. Okay. I want to break the elbow. Okay. So this is the last move in the hanshi. Yes. Okay? Very simple technique. This one's not hard. Okay? So, slow. Try it. Don't break the elbow. <laughs> you're you're right, there, right? So we're here, right? So some people are having trouble doing the, doing the arm bar. So if you can't see this, if you have to come around. So I'm here, right? I've got Woody, I've got him here, I come in here, right? So what, what do I do? What do I do is, I don't, I, I do this. So I'm here, I do this. Now, look at the space between my hands, right? But watch my head. I don't do this, I don't do this. My head doesn't move, I create this stretch here, right? Now, we do this, right? Everything in combat is size. In Tai Chi, we talk about this. You want to be bigger than the opponent. So my opponent's arm is stuck in here, right? Now, if I do this, if I just do this, right? <coughs> I'm not bigger than him. I'm just putting pressure on the elbow. He can fight that. But when I do this, there's no him fighting it because it's too late. I've already broken the arm. And again, when I'm here, nothing moves here. This is just it. That's it. It's broken. So at the touch, I break it. It's a break. Now, if I want to do it as an arm bar and control the guy, great. But if you're a civilian, that shouldn't be your intention. Now, if you manage to maybe get lucky, get the guy in a position, you can hold him down with one of the Joint locking techniques, he can't escape, you can hold him until the police get there, great. But if he's attacking you, you should look to take that arm, right? That's one weapon we eliminate. So he attacks with the right arm, we break it at the elbow. Now he's got no right arm to use. Doesn't mean he's not going to fight. What it means is we've made it harder for him by taking away the weapon, okay? So, so keep that in mind, these principles of the stretch. Okay? And I can do it different ways. I can also do it where I extend the hand, but that's like a lower level. Here, everything locks. Right? That's what I'm doing on this technique, where I wrap and come back. <coughs> I'm here, and I'm just doing this. It's the same principle. I, I don't change. I do everything the same. Okay? I'm teaching you a secret technique. I'm teaching you a secret technique. So everybody knows. How much do secrets cost? Ten dollars, no. No, no, I didn't raise it. <laughs> five dollars. <laughs> still five dollars. Leave the money on the counter on the way. Out. Giving away secrets <laughs> and wearing a red belt. Yes. Okay. So, so, Woody's in front of me. Woody comes, goes to grab me, right? Okay. Right. So that's all I'm gonna do. Right. So, Woody makes a move on me. I'm just gonna do that. Now. People will say, well, that's a front kick. No, it's not. Because a front kick, i got to pick my knee up, and i got to do this. Right? But if you watch, my foot goes directly to his foot, like that. Right? See? That was, that was his left testicle. <laughs> <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> so. <coughs> I'm here. I'm doing the hanshi. But I'm doing it as a kick. Now, is this kick going to knock him out? Is it going to completely incapacitate him? No. You think you're going to get a reaction from him? It's going to get a oh, jump back. So remember, right? If you die, what do you learn since you're a little kid? Protect what? Protect the family jewels, right? So he's not, I can tell you now, if he's like this and he goes to punch me in the face, he's never even seeing that kid coming. He won't even see it. He will not see it. You're going to try it, you're going to see it. You will not see it coming. Again, what am I doing that for? He attacks, right? I do this, now I can move in and I can follow him from the show. That initial thing does this to him, though. That's what we want. Very simple. It's weird, though. It's a weird kick. That's why it's just natural. Right on. Right on. Could this also be like, let's say, if someone's in your face yelling, right. do the same thing to the shin, right? Of course. Of course. So this this technique yeah. is a lot of things. Woody takes steps in, bang, right? So I, I kick him in. He comes in with a punch, right? And see, bang, right? So I just took out both legs, right? 
So watch, watch again. As he comes in, right? It's bang. I take this leg out, right? So as he comes in, it's, it's one, two. And I took out the second knee, too, and this is the second hip. So what is this? This is this. One, two. Now, can I change the order? It's got to be that order. No, I can do whatever I want. The form's a template. You take the template, and you're like, can I combine the first technique with the last technique? Yeah, look at this technique I came up with. Oh, wait a second. Can I take this move from Sun Tzu and use this move in the Hanshi? And if I put them together, whoa, look at that. It's a template. Pull it out. Try different things. And again, in Bunkai, right, <clears throat> you want to figure out techniques, strikes. So it becomes a strike. So for instance, this one we just did where he comes in with a straight punch and I come here and I'm doing this as an arm break. Right? It doesn't have to be an arm break. He comes in, right? I do this. Punch him here. I stretch this out. He's not going to like that. Right? I could turn this way and punch this way. Now what am I doing? I'm breaking the arm with the punch. Right? Everybody sees Sage in this. Right? But he comes in with a punch from my face. I come here. And I do here. I punch here. Break his arm. Elbow here. So slow down, examine. So what strikes can I do? Okay, then what do I do? I say, okay, now let me see what joint locks I can do, right? And we try figuring out joint locks. Now we take that same technique and we say, hey, can I use this technique from an attack from the side? And if I can, how? What about from the back? Can I use this technique as an attack from the back?